Google Wi-Fi, a mesh network router from Google. So I unboxed it today morning and I installed three routers that came along. Each of the routers are AC1200 router. Each of them comes with its own power cable which is a USB-C cable. Uh, the center one came with an additional uh, Ethernet cable. Um, otherwise each has its own USB-C uh, type cable. So USB-C is latest in the market and it kind of, these three will work in tandem uh, to pr provide a mesh network, pretty much like a wired network, but it's going to be like a mesh network which will, uh, you know, create a, a wider range of accessibility in my house. So let's hook it up, the Ethernet cable and the power cable for the primary router, just the uh, power cables for the other two access points. We need to install Google Wi-Fi app from the store. Uh, pick up your account and you should be able to set up your Google Wi-Fi and get started with it. So to do so, uh, we'll have to first plug in the uh, primary hub. Uh, so let's connect the power and the Ethernet cable. to the ISP provided modem. The setup should look something like this. Of course the wires will get hidden later on but just for the clarity I put it here this way. So now let's get started. Uh, it's looking you for can the device. see that Google app is now looking for the device. It should figure out and find the uh, primary hub. It's asking us to scan the So now it's asking me to behind. scan the QR code below the, the primary hub. So, let's so I'm going to look for it uh, below the primary hub and it will start connecting based on the QR code information. Basically it gets the identity identification from there. And now it's asking me to pick up which room it is in, like family room. And now I'm giving the SSID name here, AAA Routing, with my access password. And it starts creating the Wi-Fi network. So it's finding that I should have two more uh, possibly routers. So it's asking me if I have, and I say yes. So now it's asking me to connect the next Wi-Fi point. So I've connected the next one uh, in my hallway and it's, it's detecting and trying to add that Wi-Fi point into my network. So what the mesh network is really doing is hand creating a, a Wi-Fi based or a wireless signal based hub to hub connection. And also each hub is kind of keeping an awareness of where the primary hub is, where the van or the ISP is connected. So even here it's activating the mesh network now and now I'm connecting to the last Wi-Fi point. So do the same thing. Uh, activate this router at a specific location that I'm giving here and it will activate the mesh network on it which will always keep this router aware of where the primary point is. So now my devices can connect to this one and then get routed to the primary hub, giving me a better uh, coverage throughout my house. So it's testing its connectivity with the primary router. And as you can see now I have all the uh, hubs connected. It's updating the software on the routers. It says Google Wi-Fi is ready. So let's look at uh, you know all the facilities it gives. Uh, but I think the main thing we want to worry about is, um, apart from the support and all the activities, is how is the performance now for my routers. So I'm currently connected to my old router, uh, and I'm showing how the speed was before I connect to the Google router. So as you can see, I'm currently getting about 50 uh, 
download and close to 47 in my office room. So let's change our router to the new router, AAA routing, right? And that's our Google routers, Google Wi-Fi, and see how the mesh network is going to perform. So let's do the speed test again. So as I can invoke the speed test, uh, to my surprise, the, the speed was, instead of being faster with the faster throughput to my uh, primary access point, it's showing much less. It's only 20 now, as you can see. Uh, uh, 20 download, almost less than half uh, to my uh, secondary router to my primary router. So as you can see, there's an additional hop, which probably is degrading the performance of the overall speed uh, for my data from the cell phone. So though I get better uh, access or to the network here, uh, better bots, but I think the overall speed is much lower. I'm, I'm rerunning it to revalidate, so it's, it's close to half to my uh, speed that was otherwise going direct. And it's, it's kind of obvious because the mesh network is kind of going at an additional hop, and that additional hop is like a combination of two wireless hops, and that's kind of dropping the signal uh, considerably with, uh, with the speeds, uh, so to say.